welcome to another mic'd up workout. Today we're gonna be focusing on pull-ups. So if you are sick of the question, oh, you go to the gym, cute, how many pull-ups can you do? And your answer is zero to one. Today's workout is for you. That's what we're gonna be focusing on. And I'm really excited to walk you through today's workout. So first we're starting at a bar because if we wanna get better at pull-ups, what do we need to practice? <laughs> Hair in my mouth pull-ups. I did start with the warm-up already. You guys know Team Never Skip a warm-up. I'm gonna show you guys two extra exercises you can do to incorporate each week to help you get your first pull-up or help increase your pull-up max. First is gonna be negative, so that's where you're gonna jump to the top of the bar and lower yourself down, and you want that time to be long. You're trying to go as slow as you can, and week by week you should be increasing the amount of seconds it takes for you to go from the top all the way down to lower yourself. We're gonna go ahead and jump and slowly lower ourselves down. You could probably do one to two sets of five reps. The second one is gonna be scapular retractions. When you do a pull-up, you wanna be in this position. So practicing that first movement of those scapular retractions is really gonna help as well. But now, we're gonna start with three sets of 10 for pull-ups. I've got a thick resistance band here. The thicker, the more help you're gonna get. You can put your knee in this band or your foot. I personally like the foot, that way, when I fully extend, I'm in that pull-up position. So, let's get into our first set. Here. All right, let's move on to exercise two. Next up is gonna be a superset, so I'm gonna do a bent over rows. I'm gonna do underhand, so it helps target the mid back, a teeny, teeny bit of biceps, but overall just helps strengthen your back and core. And supersetting that with an inverted row. Inverted rows are a body weight exercise. That's just gonna help you get in the practice of pulling your own body weight, which is what a pull up is. It's pretty much like an inverted push up. You can also do those on TRX bands. It's a great exercise to really, really help you. And it also helps strengthen your core, which you need a very strong core in order to do a pull-up. We've got a lot of back and core in this superset. One is weighted and one is body weight. Fantastic. And it's really nice because you can be in the same place in the gym so you don't have to like run around for a different pieces of equipment. It's just all right here. So we're gonna do four sets of eight. Whew. All right. Let me get my headphones. All right, let's go. Eight. Make sure this doesn't fall on me. For the inverted rows, you're like in an upside down plank push up position. So feet are out straight, arms are overhand, and you're gonna pull up. Oh my gosh. On to the next exercise, we're gonna do lat pull downs. Of course, lat pull downs are gonna help with our pull ups. They're help strengthening our lats. We're doing four sets of eight because that's helping us with strength a little bit more than endurance, having a little bit lower of a rep. That way you can go a little bit stronger for those six to eight reps instead of trying to hit 10 and 12 and using your energy in that way. We're using it more on strength because we wanna have enough strength to pull our body weight up. Four sets of six to eight on these. Here we go. Man, those are really hard today. I wonder if it's also harder because I already did pull-ups and stuff. I'm, that, that's a little bit hard today, guys. All right, let's go here. So next up are going to be cable rows. This is again for mid-back. Four sets, six to eight. Loading, loading, strike for the lyrics like I'm bowling, bowling. Pushing on, keep rolling, rolling. Hello when I listen, but I told him, told him one more time. Your favorite MC's bronze or silver. These vibes here are golden, golden. Cards on the table, there's no folders. Spit bars at the club, zoning, zoning. TikTok comes to London, get ripped off. Man, get pissed off when I start lift off. Sweet life flavors, cookie, I'm pissed off. All right. Well. Cool. 
That's all I have to say. Even though we're focusing on getting a pull up, I still wanna throw in a bicep exercise because it's just so good for a back day. I always do back and biceps. So I just wanted to throw one in there. We're just doing three sets of 10. Get a nice little pump. A good cue when I do these with the easy bar, just kind of squeeze my pinkies. I don't know if that makes any sense, but that helps me so much. Keep your elbows in tight, close to your body. Keep control of that weight. Oh no, I lost count. So, nice. Whew, two more sets. We're gonna finish off this workout with a core circuit, something super quick and simple, not intimidating too much because pull-ups take a lot of core. So we're gonna do hollow body holds, a mini plank circuit, and then we're gonna do some dead bugs, all really helping strengthen the core, which is all of these muscles, not just your abs. So when it comes to a hollow body hold, this is gonna help mimic the positioning you're gonna be in for a pull-up. You're gonna try to keep your back flat against the mat. That is huge. We don't want a huge arch like this. We wanna try to keep our back flat. You're gonna lift your feet up and your hands over your head and then we'll come down. And we will do just five of those. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, once we're done with those, we're gonna do a quick plank variation. We're gonna pretty much hold a plank for 20 seconds to 30 seconds, but I wanna do movement during it. I get really bored when I just hold a plank, so this will help do both. We'll start with a high plank, and we're gonna do six, so three each side for each one. High plank, we're gonna go knee to elbow, do six. We're gonna do six up, down. Quick hold. And body saws. One, two, three. We're gonna end with dead bugs and I'm just gonna do 10. Perception. What is real? What's your projection? I make you dizzy in your head, got no protection. You're lost in the game, can't remember your name. And that's a wrap. Oh. You can repeat that circuit two to three times. Honestly, if you keep doing this workout and practice on your pull-ups, you will get a pull-up in no time. Keep it up. And I hope you like today's workout. <laughs>